Hi everyone, I'm Craig, I'm one of the instructors at the peak and today I'll be taking you through a circuits class. Alright, the circuits class is going to be three rounds. It's going to progress three reps every round and we're going to use a minute active recovery for either skipping, high knees, some sort of cardio. Alright, the three exercises we're going to use are a one and quarter squat, burpees and a single leg Romanian deadlift, all with a kettlebell or a dumbbell or you can do them body weight as well, doesn't matter too much. First of all, we need to see if you have any injuries or any concerns, any joint issues, feel free not to add the jump into the burpee, feel free to substitute things, exercises, sorry, for other exercises which are going to be healthy and good for you. So. First exercise is one and one quarter squat. Think about going down to the bottom of your squat, coming up a quarter of the way, using the glutes to drive you up, controlling back down, and then driving all the way back up. I'll go through a couple of these exercises beforehand, and then we'll get into a round. So the round, I'll show you the round of 10 reps, and then our active recovery minute, and then you can go on to do the next two rounds yourself without me. Second exercise will be burpees and third exercise will be single leg RDLs. So one and one quarter squat, like we said, so you can add in the kettlebell. What we'll look to do is squat down in your comfortable squat stance, go down to the bottom, come up a quarter, go down, back up. Down, nice and slow, up a quarter, down, back up. All right. Think about driving the knees outwards on the way up all the time actually. Think about spreading the floor away with your feet and think about not letting your knees collapse in. Burpees. Everyone's done burpees before. What we'll look for is down, jump the feet wider than the hands and you can jump. Down, jump the feet wider than the hands, jump up and then a single leg RDL. We will look to have a kickstand. So, Pop this foot, pop the opposite foot back, all right, and then we're going to go down, let the hips sink back, let the chest go forward, and come back up. That side on looks like this. So this leg, the back foot isn't doing anything at all. All we're doing is letting the hips sink back, let the chest fall forward. Should feel a big stretch up the hamstrings, and back up. All right, so we'll get into that round. So. First round will be 10 reps, second round 13 reps, and third round 16 reps, each with a minute in between for skipping, running, high knees, whatever you like. Alright, so let's get going. So, 10 reps. Don't rush these, nice and slow with these. Good control. Keeping the knees driving out over the toes all the time. Ten. All right, 10 burpees. Alright, single leg RDLs, so right leg first, left leg back, let the hips sink back, should feel a big stretch up the hamstrings.
Think about driving the hips through. One minute active recovery. And stop there, alright? If you need 30 seconds rest before you go into the next round, that's fine. Next round will be 13 reps of the same exercises. And then the following round will be 16 reps. Alright, so we'll go into a core element now. So there's going to be three exercises, 40 seconds on each, and then 40 seconds rest. You're going to go four times through, alright? So three exercises are Opposite hand to foot, a slow bike, and raise knee crunches, alright? In the opposite hand to foot, first exercise, think about lifting the shoulder blade off the mat to come and meet your foot, not your foot meeting your chest. Second exercise, a slow bike, exactly what it says on the tin, alright? Nice and slow with that one, don't rush it. You've got the time there, set a timer if you want. And then the last one is raise knee crunches, all right? So raise knee crunches, fix a point on the ceiling or at the sky. Don't move your neck too much, don't stuff up your neck. And think about touching your heels, all right? So three exercises, 40 seconds on each, 40 seconds rest, four times through. All right, so this should look like... And that's the core. Any questions on any of these, feel free to hit up the Peaks Facebook page or drop me a message. Cheers.